Hey guys, I'm Joey. He's Max Lavoie, the BBQ guru. Yes. Here at House of Barbecue Experts. And Max, uh, you gotta tell me what's going on here because I see cake, but we're grilling here. What's yeah, going man. on? Everything's better on the grill, even fruit. So we created the, the cake spice. To be true, one day we decided that we had to make something completely different. And a lot of people were like, ah, I would like to, to try uh, like, yeah, uh, to try some desserts on the barbecue and everything. So we said, yeah, everything's better on barbecue. So why not create a spice that will be the perfect accessories for any dessert? And we have created the cake, the cake spice. Why we call it cake? Because in that jar, you have a whole cake. Okay, there's no flour or anything. Don't try to mix it with some eggs and make a cake, but you have the flavor of that cake. So you put this on any kind of fruit, like a pineapple, you just grill it. It's gonna just seriously just boom, like completely create something new. You're not gonna taste that actual pineapple. You're gonna taste what heaven on pineapple <laughs> true taste. Uh, okay, give me give me two or three like awesome dessert dishes that the cake spice goes really well on when you're grilling. Actually, I will tell you other things on dessert. I could be a dessert too, but what we really do a lot with this is the candy bacon. So you take your, your bacon, you, you rub it with it, you just pour it like all over the, the bacon and you let it cook over indirect heat. So the bacon is gonna become like kind of crispy, it's gonna kind of dry, and all the sugar is gonna melt on it. So it really become, it's a dessert, but it's like a protein dessert, so it's awesome. If you mix it with a hotter spice, like a Tex-Mex, you're gonna create some kind of a mole mix that you can definitely mix with some beef. And if you love chocolate and you, you're open to different flavor, you're really gonna enjoy it. But what I really use it often to do is you put it in your coffee. If you want to change the flavor, you have it like you want to have like a, uh, a morning, like a good starter, but you want to have a day off coffee. You don't want to put Bailey's in it. You put the cake uh, spice okay. right in your coffee, and it makes it delicious. All right. So for all the dessert lovers out there who are kind of making new creations, dessert creations on their grill, yep. this is the spice they got to get, right? Oh yes, they have, and, and any fruit, seriously, any like. Apple, pear, uh, the uh, watermelon. You take your watermelon, you cut it like a steak, a real big, big slice. Put this on it and you grill it on like two or three minutes on each side. Man, it's gonna be the best watermelon you ever have. Awesome, Max, thanks. You're welcome. Perfect.